He promised to give her and her daughter a home, so she rushed to the railway station to look for her. They didn't realize Zoe was not far away. She passed her daughter by. At this very moment, Zoe was knocked down by a couple on a bike. She was praying for her daughter to be found at the train station, but the train had already left. She and her daughter were doomed to be separated. The couple were going to send the child to her parents, but Zoe said. She said she couldn't tell anyone about her mother's identity. Because the couple's family is in a difficult situation, the man didn't agree to raise someone else's child, so he's going to send her to the police station. Let the police find her parents. The man received an overtime call, so he asked someone else to take her to the police station. Then he drove off. When the man came back, he realized that the child had disappeared. Zoe found her way home by spreading breadcrumbs on the way. The woman was kind-hearted. She left Zoe at home for the night, and it was this act of kindness that saved her. Late at night, she had a stomachache and couldn't breathe. Zoe braved the rain at night and asked for help at the hospital. After years of infertility, she found out she was pregnant. Hearing that she was pregnant, her husband was overjoyed. She told him it was all thanks to Zoe. If it wasn't for Zoe, she and the baby in her womb wouldn't be here today. Zoe is a blessing to his family. Zoe had a high fever because of the rain. When she woke up, she had forgotten her name. Because of the fever, she lost her memory. That's how it was. The couple changed her name to Annie. A year later, the woman's baby was born. She was named Anna. Years later, both sisters grew up. Although they didn't have a lot of money, but the family was full of laughter. And Anne is now a courier. But she inherited her mother's talent for singing. She was born with a good voice.